Mia got the zesty rosemary chicken. <laughs> oh yes. What did you What did you think of your food? <laughs> I think there's a growing momentum to dog friendliness in general. We've seen local restaurants welcome dogs to their patios, but now one downtown eatery is offering a menu for them to order from too. So you guys are serving some dog food here at the restaurant. Yeah, it's kind of kind of a weird combination. Well-known Canadian chef David Edgy has joined forces with the Lobster Burger Bar as an ambassador, working on menu developments and other special projects. He says the idea came from simply seeing people pass by on King Street West. Watching people walking by with their dogs, dogs in strollers, and it was just kind of one of those aha moments. And they've since partnered up with the Toronto area dog food maker to give it a try, while many new pet owners are still struggling to socialize their pets mid-pandemic. Well, we know as dog moms ourselves, we want to take our dogs everywhere with us. And so the opportunity to bring your dog out to dinner with you mm -hmm. or to lunch and not have them feeling anxious at home is absolutely incredible. Can you show me what's actually on the menu? I know it's like yeah, right over yeah. there. So we've got our four meals, beef lovers, Thanksgiving turkey, zesty rosemary chicken and fisherman's catch. It's an experiment that's getting a thumbs up from at least one local dog rescue, Redemption Paws. We actually spoke with them just a couple of weeks ago and they told us they were concerned as the province was reopening, it was having an adverse effect on efforts aimed at dog adoption and fostering. With things improving, people want to be going to uh, patios, balconies, and I think a lot of people are under the idea that a dog can't partake in that. Nicole Simone founded the group and says it's part of a growing trend across North America. Finally, I think it's a wonderful thing. I think it's going to encourage people who maybe got a dog during the pandemic to take their dog out and be social. It's going to encourage people to foster. Is, is this the first time you kind of heard of a patio being like, yeah, bring your dog. We have a menu for them too. Um, first time saying you can bring your dog, no. First time saying that there's a menu, yeah. So that's, I think, what kind of sparked their interest and why we were so excited to come by. I think it's great. I mean, they're friends. They want to spend time with us as well, and it's beautiful weather. They should be out here enjoying themselves as well. <laughs> what did uh, what did Hefe order? Hefe got the it was the beef lovers, and she loved it. Anything your pets order does get added to the regular human bill, and it is an experiment. Lobster Burger Bar explaining at the end of the patio season they'll start making decisions for next year. In downtown Toronto, David Zura, City News.